Is your name Leland? Hello Sycamore, happy Marvelous Monday. Today is March 13, 2023, and welcome to this episode of our daily video announcements. I'm Frizana. And hello, I'm Lakshana, and we are so excited to be here with you all on the daily video announcements. Now let's please stand, place your hand over our heart, and honor this amazing country as we say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you all and please be seated. Remember, check work into your school emails throughout the day and be PBS responsible young adults. Be safe, be respectful, and be positive problem solvers. Go, go, go! Flexible is participating in Norman Danny's Flexible Pencil Bouncing Challenge. We hope it bounces your way. Make sure your flexible teachers registered you you have two pencil bounces. Time to mark and check your calendars for school events. Show your support and we are green tomorrow, Tuesday, March 14th, to show your support for our friends with cerebral palsy. There are over 1 million people in the United States living with cerebral palsy. Yes, we are green tomorrow, Tuesday, to support friends. We also have March 15th is our choir fine arts concerts at SHS. Again, finish this quarter strong. March 16th is the end of the third quarter. March 17th, we have no school. It is a student personalized learning day. Please note that the Sycamore Junior High Yearbook ordering deadline for 2022 to 2023 has been extended to March 17th. That means you have up until this Friday before spring break to order a book of our fun memories. Spring break officially runs from March 20 to March 24. Now we have today's Women History Month star. Hi, I'm Jake. And hi, I'm Rylan. We're here to talk about Amelia Earhart. Amelia Earhart was born July 24, 1897. Amelia was an American aviator who wanted to be the first woman to solo ride a plane across the Atlantic Ocean. While unsuccessful, she made a great story that is now inspirational. At the age of 39, Amelia left and to try and fly across the ocean. She later disappeared on July 2nd, 1937, and was presumed dead on January 5th, 1939. While her journey was unsuccessful, it was a story heard around the world that inspired many young aviation pilots. Thank you. Yeah. Well, thanks you. Next up, did, did you know? know? The blood of lobsters is colorless. However, when their blood is exposed to oxygen, it becomes a blue color. Wow, that's so cool. Next up, National mm -hmm. Day. Today is National Open and Umbrella Indoors Day. National Open and Umbrella Indoors Day on March 13th annually is a national science experiment of sorts. Open an umbrella indoors and pay attention to whether or not you suffer any bad luck. Next up, let's hear birthdays. birthdays. Happy birthday to Ava R. and Oscar R. and staff members Miss Hinson. Now over to Mr. Harris. Hey, now it's time for one of my favorite things to do, and this that, that is to present this week's Students of the Week. So our first Student of the Week, come on over and sit down, is Reese Brinker. All right, and Reese was nominated by Mr. Foley, and she was nominated for being safe, being responsible, being a problem solver, and being respectful. And again, this makes me feel really old because, you know, her mom played basketball for me. So it makes me feel ancient. But Reese, you, there's your Chick-fil-A, hon. Thank you. And there's your certificate. Thank you. Certificate. Congratulations. All right, our next student of the week, uh, come on over, is Lakshana, Lakshana Ravicha Tardrin, okay? I knew I was going to mess that up. I apologize to her beforehand, all right? She was nominated by Miss Gates, and again, she and all of these students were nominated for our PBIS virtues of being safe, being responsible, being a problem solver, and being respectful. So, Lakshana, there's your Chick-fil-A. And there's your certificate. Congratulations, hon. And last but certainly not least, come on over, Miss Jayla Donaldson. Miss Donaldson was nominated by Mr. Hammer. And again, she was safe, responsible, problem solver, and respectful. And I have her in class, and she is a wonderful child to have in class. All right. So, Jayla, there's your Chick fil A. There's your certificate. Stay here. And I'd like to thank everybody. Thank, uh, congratulate this week's Students of the Week. Give it up for our Students of the Week. 
And again, all of our students of the week were uh, nominated for exhibiting our PBIS values of being safe, being responsible, being problem solvers, and being respectful. So maybe you guys can be a student of the week. Thank you and have a great day. Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your daily video announcements. Uh, we want to start off with congratulations to the entire cast and crew of the Sycamore Junior High Musical Footloose. I heard it was a great production. Yeah, let's give it up for them. Um, I don't know if you guys appreciate how much hard work goes into putting things like that on here at school. Tremendous production. The students and adults who worked on that did a fabulous job. So congratulations to all the people involved with Footloose. Partners Club, you're going to meet on Wednesday, March 15th until 4 o'clock in the Media Center. Lots of fun games are planned, and you'll have a delicious snack. We'll also be revealing the location of our super fun field trip happening in April, as well as passing out permission slips. If you can't attend the meeting, please see Mrs. Serbless in room 103 to get your permission slip. Any 7th grade boy interested in playing soccer at the junior high next year will have a meeting during Flex Bell on Wednesday, March 15th in Mr. Tanaka's room. That is in room 240, the Upper Science Wing. You will receive a handout for dates for conditioning and tryouts, what you need to bring, and answer any questions that you may have. If you missed the meeting, please stop, stop by Mr. Tanaka's room to get the handout. Please stop by before next Wednesday, March 15th, to room 40, to get a pass from Mr. Tanaka, because you've got to have a pass to attend the meeting. So if you don't get a pass, you can't go to the meeting, then you miss soccer. So get a pass from Mr. Tanaka. That's it for me. You guys have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, Mr. Harris. Now it's time for the joke of the day. Why are robots never afraid? Why? Because they have nerves of steel. <laughs> Be extraordinary, Sycamore, and follow PBIS expectations every day. Have a wonderful week, Sycamore, and go A's! Woo!